Konnichiwa YouTubers, this is Red Stock straight from Point Magoo, California and today we're going to do a video review of SH Figure Arts Barnaby Brooks Jr. Darkness Bunny Edition from Tamashi Nation 2011. Let's take a look at the box. Tiger and Bunny. I don't watch the anime so heard it was pretty neat. I don't know. That's alright. Uh, there's a nice little silhouette and there's Tamashi Nations and just to show you, here's the side. It's a very pink silhouette. And bo box over here. Let me show you a little side by side comparison because I do have darkness. Sorry, there we go. So that's the difference between it. And I'm going to show you a little bit too so you can kind of tell the difference between the two. There's. Yeah, so as you can see, it's like a mirror silhouette. Not well, kind of, only it's a lot more dark. It's black instead of white. Uh, I kind of like the, the other version better. Yeah, you can kind of see he still has the big huge boot and everything, but let's show you what we got over here. There it is. Beautiful looking figure. Comes with a few extras. Let me show you. Comes with this nice little head, extra head, which I'm going to pop out. I like it a little better. Comes with two arms, both splayed open. This one's pointing. Pink, I love it. Another black one, or the black Raider Nation, black and silver. Good looking, good, good luck mode, a huge freaking boot. I'll show you that later on. Also comes with a stand. Barnaby Brooks Jr. Darkness Edition. Yeah, so if you need the stand, and he stands just fine, but if you need it, there you go. You can assemble it. I don't need it. Let's go look at the figure. I love this little figure. It comes, let me put this out of the way because I like I like the translucent pink. I like the gold, or I think it's cold. It moves up and down. I don't know what these are. Kind of Kamen Rider-esque in a way. Don't watch the cartoon, but very good detailing. I love the black, I like the white, I love the silver. Uh, yeah, pink is his trademark, no doubt, uh, as you can see from his old school. And yeah, let's see what it says, Bandai, Amazon.com. So he's like a freaking ad advertisement from anything. No ads on this base. So yeah, pink translucent on his shoulder blades. And speaking of his shoulders, look how it moves in and out, up and down, ball jointed. You got a bicep swivel, single jointed elbow, sing, or ball jointed wrist. You got a little wrist guards or whatever these are, translucent pink. I'm loving it. Translucent pink ears. I love that pink. Pink is pretty dominant. Pink, silver, black, white. Those are the primary colors. Little paint ops over here, little splash over here. So make sure you watch that or watch it when you're buying. I didn't even have a choice since it's a mail order thing. His neck does crane so he can look down ball jointed if not limited by the collar so he do, can't move that much on the neck let's see what other things ab crunch waist swivel doesn't move too much he got not only does he have a ball jointed hip joint but upper thigh swivel you can shrug up and down so you can definitely move them up much more range of motion Double jointed knee, okay. Boots on a swivel, and a little toe swivel. So you can definitely put him in good mo points of articulation. He's looking good. Looking from the back here, great detailing, like the black, very silvery finish, gunmetal gray, silver. Yeah, loving it. Love the pink. Look at the highlights on that. Look at the highlights on the pink. Pink everywhere. I like that little silver pink deal over here. So. Let's give him some attachments here so you can see. I love this face better. All you have to do is just pop up the head, replace it. Yeah, I like it. It just looks better to me. It has those pink highlights for the eyes. White little tip for the goatee. Good. Oh, yeah. And the hands. Gotta be pink, man. Gotta be pink. You know, I, I just had issues with this. and In order to make it easier, all I have to do is just pop that off. And I just pop the hands right in. I love the pink. I love the daring combination there. <laughs> More pink. Yeah, I like the black stripes. Just great attention to detail. I like this figure. It's a little rare to get because it's a mail away, mail away exclusive. But yeah, translucent pink everywhere. Has his hands outstretched. Looking good. Yeah. What can I say? Oh yeah, and the big boot. Let's go ahead and change it. I have trouble changing this thing out. Usually what I do is I rotate the hip joint outward something like that so I can pop this sucker out may not get it. that one luckily got it on that try 
So yeah, I'm not going to put the boot too far in because it's a pain to do so. So I'm just going to put it so I can pop it back out and put it on my display. So yeah, the big boot, just to show you, it just pops right back in. Uh, still can bend at the knee. Has that great detailing over here. Uh, little scratches here and there. I like the different color in the brown, gold, more of a copper color. Uh, we'll see what else we got. Has a huge boot swivel and this does move out of the way. So if you wanted to attack and stuff, yeah, he can give you a big boot. <laughs> Has some writing in there. B China, I think. Yeah. Anyways, beautiful looking. Kind of makes it awkward to pose. And that's okay. <laughs> Yeah, awkward pose, I know. And I'm not going to pop that in. No, I'm going to try to pop it in. There we go. Get in there. I'm just going to put his foot back. So you get the gist. That's how you do it. I like the uh, other ones. It's easier to pose that way. Let me give you a size comparison. As soon as I get that stood up. If I can't, that's okay. Here's Megatron. <laughs> He's about five and a half inches, so... Let me go ahead and put that back. There we go. Five and a half inches. Good to go. Looking good. I can't say many good things about this. Eight and a half out of ten. That's all I got, YouTubers. And i catch you all next time.